This is from the 80s when the 900 numbers were big. Oh, they were hot. <laughs> this is so funny. Which one are you going to play first? The one with both. Okay. <laughs> Listen to That's the process. Right. Corey Heyman and Corey Feldman are giving out their personal oh numbers. My God. If you call 1 900 909 3700, you They're can so listen cool. to their private phone messages and get their personal number where you can leave them a message of your own. $2 the first minute, 45 cents each additional minute. <laughs> Ask your parents before you call. 1 900 909 3700. There is dancing. If you call me right now, I'll give you my private number. Um, you call that number and you'll hear a recording, and I'll give you my personal number if you call that. No. Um, Why do you call the first number? And we'll wrap. It will rap. What do you mean? It will rap. What do you mean? You call a number and then I'll give you my personal. What? Yeah, it will rap. Well, then you make money twice, and right? And it said in there you leave a message. Like, do you even talk to him? Do you listen to a message? You I think you hear just an hear example? Bullshit. Yeah. Um, well, play play that commercial over again. Listen to the process for calling the one nine hundred Corey's line. <laughs> Sketchy. You call a number to get a to get a number. Corey Haim and Corey Feldman are giving out their personal numbers. If you call one nine hundred nine zero nine thirty seven hundred, you can listen to their private phone messages and get their personal number, where you can leave them a message of your own. Two dollars the first minute, forty five cents you can listen to the message. Minute. Ask your parents before you call one nine hundred nine zero nine thirty seven hundred. Video is great. If you call me right now, I'll give you my private number. Um, you call, call me that right number, now. and you'll hear a recording, and I'll give you my personal number if you call that. Um, and we'll rap. <laughs> no, you're, you're not rapping. You're calling your per, your personal number, which then you're leaving a message on. You're never fucking talking to Feldman or Hayne. No, why would you leave them a message? But ask you're your parents first. A message. They're never going to listen to the message. <laughs> no, but Drew, it's their personal number. Maybe they will. Oh, yeah, that's right. Now you have their personal number. That's great. And then you can call for free. Their personal How? landline? <laughs> How many idiots called that number? I don't know. I have no idea. But then there's, <laughs> for some reason, there's a Corey Haim hotline all by itself. Only? Yeah. Or at least I, he this, shows up in it. This might have been first or after. I don't know, but listen to how dumb this is. Hamer. Hey, are you a good kisser? Yeah, I think I'm. A, I think I'm a good kisser. Oh my god. Or I think, um, from what I've heard, from what I've been told, the feedback I've gotten is, y you're a great kisser. You're a good <laughs> kisser. You kiss good. Call one 3300 and you're straight from. It's a court. different number. Two dollars for the first minute. Forty-five yeah, cents your for each additional minute. Call one 3300 Call me, 1-900-909-3300. It's very important. I have a lot to tell you guys. Please call me. <laughs> I have a lot to tell you guys. Bullshit. Is this another message, or are you actually talking to him? I don't think you talk to him. You, no, there's no way. You could kiss her. Call me. It's very important. How did they do I Like, I could see him do a, doing a few takes. And, oh, this one's perfect. We'll use 10 seconds of you talking about kissing. <laughs> of course. How dumb was that? How old are they, too? Are they, like, 15 there? Yeah, 14, 15 during that. Yeah, you can hear his voice kind of changing. What's I'm the 900 kisser. number story? This one here. Does yeah. it still work? Is that, that 900? Tesh? John Tesh. Long ago, parents thought of the X rating when the subject of 900 telephone calls arose. But now the sex-related aspect of the calls appears to be on the wane. And new services offering entertainment information are gaining in popularity. <laughs> Dialing 900, our inside story for today. Oh, this sounds like a heavy piece of journalism. <laughs> 976 or 900 to most people may mean either dial a porn of the X rated variety yeah. or those dating or nice. party lines advertised late at night. Oh, fake. We got Mickey, we got Judy, we got Crystal. However, legislation has their underwear. Much of the objectionable so called Look at these phone old sex. Birds. And the novelty has Is worn off. Strom Thurmond? Oh my God, was it? <laughs> yes. The programs are down about 30% and revenues Pacific are down Bell. 50%. But if 900 has become less sex, it's become more of everything else. This is a recording session for a 900 number, which brings callers up to speed on the CBS network soap opera. Will Sweet Dick Willie get there in time? Find out today. 900 puts you in touch with Freddy Krueger. It brings you news from the world of professional wrestling. It'll even keep track of Elvis for you. The editor of a publication which monitors the 900 industry says, by now, nothing surprises her. I was hearing some of the most outlandish, wonderful. Uh, UFO sighting How crappy this video gets after through the years. <laughs> it's so bad. And it's on a tape. Today, companies which call themselves information providers... Did you guys ever call those numbers? I used to call 1-900-WET-TITS. Yeah. ...and dial 900. 
Not surprisingly, the hottest line. <laughs> Why did that what turn you on? Well, you can call Will Smith. No, this is Jeff. We Rappers DJ, DJ Jazzy, Jazzy Jeff, Jeff and the Fresh Prince stand to make a handsome profit from their 900 line, as does Al B. Sure and teen idol Corey Haim. I think I'm a good kisser. <laughs> I think. Not everybody is in love with 900. Just the thought of a 900 number, you know. That really makes me feel guilty and low. Oh, she Angela must have called Kovac, a thousand Kovac, times. Arizona thought it would be fun she to call Corey Catholic Haim's school. 900 number <laughs> once. It didn't work out that way. Kisser. No. <laughs> Called a lot more. About 216 times. Oh! <laughs> the final tab for Angela's repeated call to Corey's line... More than five hundred and seventy dollars uh, in a single month. Uh, God, that's beyond like the bill, Angela's now. mother saw a transformation in her daughter after a steady what? diet of the wisdom of Corey Haim. <laughs> she had uh, the, the colors that he liked. Uh, she wanted to use sun in hair product to lighten her hair. Sun in. Uh, the foods she wanted to eat Chinese food because that well, was she's a fucking food. idiot she then <laughs> exactly what, what a dope your kid has no on chance. this kid it's wonderful man it's an honor to have I hope the influence as well as the um recognition I didn't know that he was getting all this money for it and, what do you, you think who do you think was getting did you watch a commercial it seem like that many calls but it is Haim's hotline is not currently active. One which is connects callers to a recorded message Backstreet? from New Kids on the Block. Or New Kids on the Block. <laughs> <laughs> Anything to fuck up kids. Oh, it sounds like the two bar ring. Oh, it's like calling out. Like call their notes. line has spawned unauthorized rip-off lines and a flurry of lawsuits this week filed by New Kids on the Block against their imitators. <laughs> Regardless of the outcome, <laughs> imitators. is undeniably the new kid on the home entertainment block. A 900 number for viewers of NBC's game show Scrabble yielded more than a million calls. It's explosive at this point. Uh, it's it's quite, a, quite a journalistic piece, isn't it? What's doing. We're watching 60 way, Minutes here. The <laughs> Entertainment Tonight, baby, with John Tesh. All right. Oh, oh God. <laughs> Corey. <laughs> this is Corey Lines. I'd love great. to know how much money they made off of that. <laughs> for real. <laughs> Probably a lot. Oh, fuck. I mean, seriously. They were that, they were that big. Aim's a good kisser. <laughs> yeah, just call around. call this number, and uh, and then I'll leave you my personal number, and then you call me and leave a message. <laughs> what? what? No, he said, well, then we'll rap. Like, no, you won't. <laughs> Liar.